since I was a teenager. I'm now 69 years old, almost. I've been overseas several times to fix and teach sewing machine repair. I've been in New Jersey several times to fix sewing machines. I'm in the center of South Carolina. I go to Charleston to fix sewing machines. They'll call me down there. He's a Columbia. He'll say, I can't get it fixed up him. I'll go up and fix it. I've had to sing a guy whenever he has a problem to get a sewing machine running. Worked on sewing machines that ran from 4,000 to 7,000 stitches a minute. This one here has got three skips in it. So the three needles in this machine is skipping out of a hundred. Set up is go automatically. Bring it off. So both sides. It came from the storm room where I came from. They didn't know they started making these machines for these mattress companies. Ever since I was a teenager, I've been head from mechanic in three different plants. One plant had over 900 employees working on sewing machines that ran from 4,000 to 7,000 stitches a minute. A really expensive and complicated equipment. I've taught sewing machine repair. I've been overseas a few times to fix sewing machines and teach sewing machines. I've been in Philadelphia several times to fix sewing machines. I've been all over the state of South Carolina and even did work for the singer guy whenever he'd ask me, he said, Jerry, go go to go there or there and fix a sewing machine. I can't get it going. I did that for the last 30 years. He'd call me at the plant and I'd go out and fix it. Help him out, help him get his equipment running.